Thank you, Nathan. More jobs are set to come to North Little Rock soon as city officials announce plans for a new Dollar General distribution center. THV 11's Jay Jackson has more on how an opportunity for economic growth might be just right around the corner. It's here near the Amazon Fulfillment Center that project heads are looking to place the new distribution center. It would initially bring in over 300 jobs with 600 happening over time. These jobs are no longer $11 an hour jobs. These jobs are actually getting up into 18, 19, 20 dollars an hour. They have good strong benefit packages with them. They're places where you can work and actually advance. Robert Birch is the director of development for the city of North Little Rock. He says this 152 acre area is looking to be turned into an almost 1 million square foot dollar general distribution center. All air conditioned and heated and climate controlled all throughout. The center will hold cold storage for produce to add groceries to Dollar General locations, which Birch says amid the pandemic will offer more healthy options for the city. North Little Rock and Little Rock Chambers of Commerce have been big, big helps for us. I'm in the mind that a rising tide raises all ships and bringing a business of that magnitude here in North Little Rock is going to help all of our businesses here, specifically the chamber members, just with those relationships, because these new employees, you know, th uh, 300 initially growing up to 600 is a huge, huge deal. Daryl Hartwick with the North Little Rock Chamber of Commerce says they'll be hands on to help with the project. Birch says it's been in the works since the beginning of the year. Once the city council finalizes the last terms of the project, construction could begin in late January or early February. I've got family that lives out uh, outside of Conway in Enola, Arkansas, which is like 300 people. And on the way there, in the middle of nowhere, there's a Dollar General, and it's always crowded. So they're filling the, they're filling the need. In North Little Rock, Jade Jackson, THV 11 News. Jade, thank you. There are some tax incentives involved in this package, and the city council will have to sign off. They'll do that on January 10th at a public meeting.